Beanie. Rise and shine, sleepyhead. Good morning, Admiral Bubbles. I swear he smiles at me. Isn't he the sweetest thing? Don't be fooled, Mom. It's an act. He's the most evil, diabolical creature. Yeah, yeah, I've heard that one before. Just hurry up or you'll be late for school. Ah! Yeah, I'll say. We have bugs! Huh? I was talking about my room. Your room? Oh, of course, yes. Don't touch anything. There's bound to be more of them crawling about with their hairy little legs. Yuck! Come on, Mom. It was only a little bug. Little? Little? It was huge! Monstrously big, in fact. I better go check my bed. Did you put that bug in my bed to scare Mom? Dear, dear Beanie, perhaps if you took a bath once in a while, you wouldn't have bugs in your bed. Besides, why would I do such a thing? Because you're a twisted, diabolical monster of a fish that would sell his own mother for- Yes, yes, well, I can't disagree. But although I quite enjoyed your pathetic display at bug hunting, alas, I had nothing to do with it. I didn't do it, but... This just gave me a wonderfully horrible idea. Oh, wait, I forgot something. Hurry up and watch out for bugs. Ha! Maybe you thought I forgot. A fish can dream. But a genius fish overcomes obstacles. I'm afraid this shall be too easy. Maybe I should start performing my schemes blindfolded. Nah, it's too much fun to watch. That's right. Crawl out of your hiding places. I have plans for you. Bugs around. Let's hope not. Glad to see you didn't try anything funny. I kept falling asleep reading these books you left me. It's a shame that you don't seem to have advanced beyond a third grade reading level. I mean, little fluffy bunnies go shopping. Really, Beanie. Knock it off. They were gifts from my aunt. Anyway, look what Mom just bought for you. Oh, endless joy. And I'm not afraid to use it. No, sir. Try anything funny and whoosh! Caught in my net. The world is safer already. Feeny, the supper's on the table. Just a second! I'm feeding my fish! That's funny. I swear it was full this morning. Did you eat all the food? How could I have? Trapped as I am under these dreadful books. I guess I'm wrong. And you so often are, poor boy. Beanie, supper is ready. I'm coming, I'm coming! 
You know, the latest issue of Constant Conspiracies warns about these. They say it's a ploy to sell more. Instead of killing them, it really makes them stronger and breed faster. And so you have to buy more of the stuff and so on and so on and so... Well, one problem at a time. Let's try getting rid of them first. Now it's time for you to get to bed. Makes them stronger? Yuck. Good luck to you all. The ones that don't freeze will have the honor of being chosen as my agents of destruction. Careful, be very careful. Oh, thank goodness it's empty. Looks like we don't have a roach problem after all. This isn't a roach problem. This is going to be my roach solution. They're gone. So are mine. And look, my clothes are all gone. Right, because for a moment there I thought your closet had gotten bigger. I take it you don't have an explanation for this? Very fashionable burglars? Beanie, I'm not kidding. I'm going to be late for... Did you just see your bathrobe slide by? Yes. Please don't be it. Please don't be it. Please be him. Please be him. I knew it. I should have known. It can't just be cockroaches either. No, it's got to be clothes stealing ones. Are you in cahoots with this bug? Don't be insulting. I've got better associates than... Enough is enough. I'm calling the exterminators and get rid of that awful bug. Rocket exterminators, what seems to be the problem? We've got a roach invasion. A oh, roaches, is that all? Yes, and they took all our clothes. Okay, we'll send someone right over. Let me just check our schedule. Oh, you're in luck. <laughs> we'll be there in two, maximum three weeks from now. Did you say three weeks? I sure did. See you then, and thanks for calling Rocket Exterminators. Miserable roaches. Come on, Beanie. Let's get this day over with. Going to school in my pajamas? I'll be the coolest kid in class. You too, Mom. Your friends at work are going to be so jealous of you. Oh, I can't wait to hear what they have to say. So you really sleep in these little ducky pajamas, huh? Anyway, my mom's totally freaked out by a harmless bug. And yet she's completely blind about the Dark Lord of Doom in our lives. Dark Lord of Doom? Admiral Bubbles? Of course. Nice touch. Although, he's more of a Duke of Devastation. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe the Maestro of Mayhem. The Wizard of World Domination? <laughs> the King of Complete Chaos? Can I play too? What are we talking about? Um, my goldfish? There's a rumor around school that you think your goldfish can talk. <laughs> yeah, kids today.
you seen my romance novels? I can't find any of them. Mom, I've got some bad news. I'm not sure I'm in the mood for this, Beanie. My guess is we're facing a new breed of clothes-eating roaches. I don't know how Admiral Bubbles is connected, but... Beanie, your theory shows a healthy imagination, but we'll let the professional exterminator handle it, okay? In the meantime, don't touch them. They're dirty. But Mom, I think we're on top of something big! If you want to do something, just help me find one of my romance novels. Anyone will do. Roachinator 3000? The ultimate in pest control technology, huh? Now that's what I call express shipping. Say, what is that? The Roachinator 3000. Tomorrow's technology to get rid of today's bugs. Whoa! Emergency. We're about to be overrun by an army of mutant cockroaches controlled by my goldfish. Is this Mr. Beanie? Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. I've had it with your outlandish crank emergency. Don't call here again. Looks like I'm on my own. Nobody move! What? Isn't it a little late to go out for a bit of fresh air? <laughs> One move and I'll call the cops. In fact, they're on their way right now. Oh, please. We both know nobody's coming. Is this Mr. Beanie? The one who calls three times a day about his monstrous goldfish? Don't call here again, blah, 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 blah. Well, I know someone who'll believe me, you twisted aquarium monster. Mom! 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 <laughs> She's not coming, Beanie. My roach underlings are taking care of her. 
<laughs> you, on the other hand, are lucky. From where you're hanging, you'll have the best view of my moment of triumph. Behold! My genius creation! <clears throat> uh, excuse me. I said, behold! What was the point of all that training, you brainless bugs? Behold, my genius creation! Frozen roaches? No, you idiotic biped! They're burning hot. Burnt roaches? I, I don't get it. Not burnt roaches. My very own mutant cockroaches. I've been secretly breeding them in your freezer, feeding them with my special mix of hot peppers, antifreeze, and your mum's romance novels. I've turned them into powerful love furnaces. Better roaches, huh? I don't think we really needed that, you know. Oh, but I do. And in a few moments, I'll launch these two six-legged sizzling lovers off to the polar ice caps, where they will rapidly reproduce into the billions and completely melt the ice, thus raising the ocean level and finally drowning out your useless civilization. It will be magnificent, don't you think? No, you can't do this. This is so evil. Why, yes, it is. Thank you for noticing. You're not welcome. I can't let you go through with this. Oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. <laughs> Told you so. I'm gonna get out of this net. Faster, you six legged slugs. I haven't got all night. Finally, now inflate the thing. I meant, release the fire roaches! <laughs> so long, lover bugs. I'm sure the honeymoon will be hot. I'm afraid it's not that easy to stop my progress. So long. You'll soon hear from me. I'll send you a thousand foot flood! <laughs> oh no, this can't be happening. Hey, that's it. I'll use the vacuum cleaner to harpoon it, and I'll reel it back in with a cord. Life is great. A moonlit night, beautiful weather, doomed people sleeping below. What more could a goldfish want? What the? Amazing! I never would have thought you were capable of such a feat. I'm actually impressed. And you're soon to be distressed. It was nice of you to visit, but don't let me keep you. But before I go, let me give you a hand. Do you know you have a serious roach problem? No! My plan! My beautiful plan! What have you done?
How nice of you to invite me back to your place. Sorry, but I really can't stay. Mind if I just drop you off? Mom's back in charge. What's the matter, Beanie? It's not that fun being a pet at the mercy of your master, is it? Hey, Admiral Bubbles, all this evil activity must make you work up an appetite. How about a snack? How dare you? And I don't even like this cheap brand. Gotcha! Don't be ridiculous. I haven't yet begun to fight, my little... Are you all right? I'm really sorry, but it's all Admiral Bubble. Oh, I made quite the mess. Let's get you back to bed. I'll clean up tomorrow. I'll help you clean up too, Mom. The kitchen is a mess, but nice work on the bug zapping. I guarantee you that the house is roach-free now. Yes, it's good to know that there will be no more evil pests running around here. Maybe just one more, Mom. <laughs>